Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Autumn Embers and welcome to part 15 of the Black Widow Challenge. I'm starting this part off here because Scarlet ha Scarlet has gone into labour, which is why Evan looks so panic and distressed. Like, oh my god, I don't want to do. So I'm going to take Scarlet off to the hospital in her lovely towel and hopefully she's gonna give birth to an alien. No, yes, an alien, because um, Midnight 51, this is who he looks like without his alienness on. He, he's an alien and he's out jogging. He doesn't even know what's happened. He, he, she's, in, she's pregnant, she's in labor. So we're gonna go to the hospital. I don't know how you do that. I've done it before, but I can't remember. She's in labor, she's gonna give birth any minute now. Um, more choices, have baby hospital. So we are here at the hospital. She has changed out of her towel and into her everyday wear. And now she, I'm just gonna get her to, there's no one on the desk and there's no one on the desk, what? I would like to give birth, order, order what? No, I just want, I, will, I would like to give birth, please, please. Please, 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 can I give birth? Is that all right? Invite no. I just want to. I just want to pop. I just want this little little baby out of me. Would be lovely. Is that a thing that you can you guys can do? Please. Let's go here. Let's let's add baby Dada to our group. More choices, actions. Okay, is it in our group? Okay, all right. Okay, can we just go to the front desk and hopefully we can go from there. So let's go in together. Come on. Right, I'm in my gown. My uh, unfluttering gown. Can I please give birth now, please? No. What do I do? I can't. Why is he in the line? You shouldn't be in the line. You should be. You should. There we go. Right, there we go. Okay, baby Dan is not coming with, is he? Who's treating us? We need, we need, we need someone. Where's, where's the, where's the doctor? Where's me, where's the, where's the, what's the, what's it called? Um, midwife. Okay, here we go. Oh, hee hee hee. There we go. So hopefully this baby is an alien. So we've got a vampire, we've got a spellcaster, and hopefully, oh, why? What's up with the boys? I don't mind it, but we're having the luck that Henry VIII didn't have. What's up with all these boys? So it is a uh, sky. It's just going to a baby boy. So we need a baby boy alien kind of a name. So, well, I'm just gonna call him Spot for now. I can change his name, but Spock. Is Spock with a, with a K or was it with a CK? I made Spock, but I still don't know. Spoke. Spock. Yeah, CK. Spock Masters. There we go. Oh, 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 oh. Congratulations. Thank you. What does the baby look like? It looks like a baby. Hello, little one. Hello. So we are back at home and um, just to refresh, just for so if you didn't get what was going on, this is Midnight 51. This is what he looks like with his disguise on. So he's an alien, he moved in the last part and this is what he looks like. Um, in the last part, his sister, Skylar, I believe her name was, she unfortunately passed away and steamed to death in the sauna, which by the way, we are going to put in our inventory because we've got another baby, which means Raven, when the kid grows up, when Spot grows up, when Spot grows up, we're gonna move Raven into here. So let's just get rid of these walls. I know Chance was here. But giving birth at the hospital was important. So there we go. So that's going to be Raven's room. Because we've only just moved moved into his. And I don't want to move again. Because that's why. And she's only got 10 days left. So it's a bit pointless for moving again. But here is Spock Masters. We've got so many people in this family now. But uh, midnight will not last very long. Because... In this part, I would like for 
midnight and Scarlett to get married. So uh, we are just gonna wait till the morning to have the marriage, the, the wedding to go ahead. So she's not really in a, in a bad mood. So she's just going to use the toilet, perhaps say hello to Spock, make silly faces, um, cuddle, going to do a bit of uh, talking to. Oh, yeah, that's that's uh, Raven's friend, Piers. He's been coming around. So Raven has a friend. Um, do you need to do your homework, do some homework, all about you? I try to change Cosmo's looks, I'm not, I'm not the biggest fan of it really. And I try to change, I change his hair, I change his clothes, and when I went back into play mode, uh, his eyes, his white, cute, creepy eyes, they disappeared as, and I tried again and again and every try, time I tried his eyes would just disappear so I'm just going to take his flat hat hair for his white creepy eyes because I prefer his white creepy eyes and and to his cuteness so I'm gonna I'm gonna leave it like that I'm just gonna cope and deal with it because every time his creepy white eyes kept disappearing so he's doing his homework whilst chatting to hopefully our oh, there's just acquaintances but hopefully Piers is going to become our new best friend so uh, Midnight 51 is talking to Evan because Evan was around here and because I think Evan was the one who helped Scarlet with the labour what is that? what is that? Uh, Spock is very hungry. Oh, we can we can feed Spock. But what is that? Black and why we've got that? Why why do we have some fish on the floor? Okay, let's just pop that over there. So we're gonna feed Spock. Uh, live long and prosper. I can't I can't do the hand, you know the hand signal that Spock has. I can't do it. Uh, we we can but we're gonna feed Spock. There we go. I don't has. I'm gonna change Midnight Fifty One into his other disguise. His alien, because I don't know if he has like pointy ears. Wait, Evan, get away from my child! I need to feed him. My my feedingness of him is greater than your cooing over a dirty, stinky Spock baby. No. This is not what I wanted. I just wanted to change his disguise, not actually alter his disguise. I want this cancel. I I I like his alien form. I like his human sim form. It's fine. It's got the little little bow tie. Right, so we're back for a minute. Then like, oh no, I haven't saved. It's taking too long, but it, it got, came through. Let's just save now. Okay, let's just say we'll be fine. Otherwise, I have to go through getting the knees back up, stop making them feel sad. Because that took such a long time to do. What is happening? Okay. So, I just wanted to know what your alien does. Your alien form has pointy ears like Spock, the, the actual Spock from Star Trek. Um, okay, we move disguise. Right. Have we done that? Was the baby growing? Shh. It's just right. Shh. Did I need to feed you? Scar can now ground children who have misbehaved. For a softer approach, you can now discuss the bad behaviour and hug it out. She has access to more ways to solve kids' motives. Right. Are you right, sweetie? Okay. We're gonna bounce. We're gonna bounce, bounce, bounce. We're gonna talk. And then we're gonna put you down. And then we're going to. Uh, we do it. We're gonna add holiday what time is it okay it's gonna be cloudy but that's fine uh we're going to we're going to add event there we go get get married to our beloved fiance wedding there we go i'm not too sure we need a gold event so there we go guest required we are going to buy jasminda aran anya by the way, they've been very loud and noisy, and I can't tell when our neighbours been loud, loud and noisy because our lift is in the way. We're gonna invite our old landlady and Chance because we don't really 
mind about him anymore and that is it all right about her a doctor a midwife oh there you go caterer yes sure let's hire the role let's get a mixologist i'm not too sure the if the um the lot of plop down has a has a bar but let's see shall we so i want so yeah a plop down an actual wedding place so hopefully it's here i got it from the gallery i'll pop there we go i pop the name of the person who did this in the description box below so this is definitely tomorrow night so let's do let's do a 11 a.m wedding so it's quite an early wedding i don't know what time weddings normally go off i've only been to two um yes okay right okay does he have pony ears oh yeah he does it's pony ears so our spock may have have pony ears like the other spock in star trek um so could you disguise self Woo! there we go so let's let's get midnight 51 away from the apartment so scarlet can go have a little bit of fun with somebody else so this is what I used to do when um, I was sort of like this sort of gameplay when I was doing The Sims 3. I used to always send my Sims to the uh, spa and go for a massage. I was like, do you want to go for a massage? Yeah, sure. Because the other Sim who was staying at home was inviting around other Sims. Um, so we had Evan over who helped her out with the labour. And then we're gonna invite round. Who shall we invite round? Um, could invite Rate Caden round. Oh yeah, let's invite Caden round. Hang on, no, wait, hang on. Which ones? Um, um oh, let's invite Roland round. Uh, so invite him round, and then we're gonna have a baby <laughs> with him, and then the baby with the rest of the Yoda family. Um, so yeah, lots of doubling up I think with this apartment and also I could push the living room slightly over to that way. Oh, um, Evan, could you, could you please go, leave, send home, bye bye. Uh, so we could push the living room over this way and um, add like a room here, hopefully. And so, yeah yeah so that could create like another bedroom um so we are going to not invite saying though because we've got our fiance who's living here uh so we don't want to do that so let's do a bit of romance do a little bit of embrace like hey sweetie oh it's been too long um ask about career what do you do are you retired what's happening are you just working through because you like to work um, so let's do a little bit of a risque question. Are you wearing love heart underpants? I would love to know. Or would you like a um? Would you like a? Would you like a hug? Uh, no, kid, no, no. Leave the baby alone. Leave, leave for your life. You. Oh. No, no, go here, go there. Yeah, oh, ho, ho. I was too, I was too, I was doing good. It's about the stupid kid being in the room. Okay, go jogging. There we go. Go jogging, your fitness nuthead. There we go. Oh, ho, ho. that was a close one, wasn't it? Okay, kid, go away. But we can, I was saying, we can have a baby in the shower. Oh, um, I know, I know that baby in the shower is not a new thing, but they they have like a different interaction with the bathtub, so more choices, <laughs> baby. <laughs> okay, right, Roland, there we go. Going babies like there's no tomorrow. Okay, where is he? Whoopsie doopsies. Where is he? Okay, he's jogging. He's fine. He's jogging. Oh, what's this? What's this? Look for snooze. No, you just keep jogging. Right, just keep on jogging, my own fuel pop. Right, he's gonna have something to eat. Okay, <laughs> a bit frisky in the bathroom. 
to get some leftovers. <laughs> What's Cosmo doing? So he's just on the tablet. Okay, we're gonna open up the fridge and he's gonna have some leftovers. He's gonna have some, hopefully you can get that, glab serving. And then once you've done what you needed to doodles, you are going to go and feed, breastfeed, I don't know what the kid needs. No, <laughs> hello. There we go. He's definitely outside jogging. Yes, he is. Lovely jolly. <laughs> oh, I was so close. Oh, 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 imagine he caught us just before the wedding. Oh, no. Okay. What are you doing, sweetie? Okay. Right. Okay. What? Did you see that? She's on the other side. She went for a wall. Yeah. Can she get back? Oh, there we go. We go. Oh, she went. She went. It was. It was a bit too much. It was a bit too whooshiness. There was a bit too. Okay. Well, are you pregnant, sweetie? I know you just given birth. I'm satisfied for woohoo. Wait, for mediocre woohoo. We never had that. That who? That woohoo wasn't satisfactory. Improvement needed. Oh, that's harsh. <laughs> Uh, clean and satisfied. <gasps> that was from the. That was from his son. <laughs> so the son needs improvement, but the dad, yeah, he he's he's had some good experience because that was great, apparently. So where is our lovely fiance? Okay, okay. Do you want to look for snow globes? Oh, what snow globe are you gonna get? So let's just do that, and then he, then Cosmo is gonna grab a serving if you can. I'm not too sure if you can. From the dusty depths of the flea box, Midnight has received Magnolia Steamboat Snow Globe. Yes. So there we go. Spock, what are you doing? You're being blessed, fled. There we go. Is he waddling over there? Can he grab it? Well, he's waddling there. You, sir, you can go home. Let's do this. Let's send home because you can do this without insulting that. Oh, how bloody dare you. Uh, you invite me around for this and you just, you just ask me to leave. But now I can send them home. They won't be offended. Wonderful. So, a spark, what's, I should really go now. Yeah, yeah okay. So, we, our oh, Scarlet is a little bit sleepy. So, let's get some beauty sleep before our wedding at 11. Oh, exciting. And then Cosmo is eating at the moment, I think. I can't see him. Oh, that's why he's on the little chair, that's why. So let's pop this away. We've got a ghost. We've got Caleb. Oh, I got a notification saying that Caleb spirit is going to fade away sooner or later. But okay, yeah, sure. Whatever. So he is feeling fit and dandy and ready for the wedding thingy, yes honey, I'm looking suave. So let's take a thoughtful shower and then go and go to use the loo and then you're gonna go to Betty Buys. Raven, sweetie, have you done your homework? Because you are a beast, you? you're okay with a little brain box now. And then he's gonna do his extra credit and then he's gonna use the loo. And then he's then gonna write and write in journal because uh, it's a good thing to doodles. So what has he got for like crack before these traits? Right, his manners are awful. Um, negative manners are earned by burping or farting, swearing, or rude introductions. Toddlers take their clothes off in front of strangers. Yeah, but what does what what happens if he locks down that bad manners? But responsibility and emotional control are oh, great. Um, so Caleb is on his phone. Wonderful. So he's doing that. What is Cosmo doing? Well, if you eat quicker and do your extra credit. Oh, okay. Go to the loo and then do your extra credit because you don't want to pee your pants. Okay, there we go. Ugh, fame. So what's Raven doing? Like, could you put yourself like go to the loo? Uh, let's go to the loo first. Go to the loo. Go to the potty. 
Right, go to sleep. How are you doing? Well, you're fine, you're getting there. What are you about you? I do like this guy so but it's a shame but he will he will he will die. Right, I I saw someone ask on Twitter like what's the best way for like, him to go? Um and someone said laugh yourself to death. And I was like, oh, I've never done that one. But apparently this person does it all the time. It's like, I've never done that emotional death. But then again, I don't really do emotional deaths. So I was like, oh, perhaps Evan could go, not Evan, 51, midnight 51. Perhaps he could go laughing, you know. So let's, tr so we're going to try that one out on uh, 51. But we need to get married to him in first. So I'm going to see you then um, at the wedding ceremony was they gonna get married so uh at the wedding event we are uh, what's well, guys having a wedding so this like i said it is the wedding venue that i got from the um the gallery and i'll post the um the name of the person who made this in the description box below and apologies if you hear raised voices um me mom and dad are, are downstairs and I think they're doing the crossword and they get very excited and a bit too into the crossword but there we go so um wedding I don't want this end holiday I don't want to end me wedding right wedding okay we hang an awful amount in the towel that's fine that's what a good wedding um what is this um enlightened and inspired okay whatever um we 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 are gonna get married wow so that's a big arch um so let's use this come one come all do we need anything else to do do we like hi thanks for coming there is no there is no sort of like things to doodles um i think i've done that wrong um uh, thanks for yeah go thanks for coming please don't leave me um thanks for coming thank you thank you for coming um to my fourth wedding um thanks for coming thanks for coming chance i'm so sorry about that whole thing of trapping you in the sauna <laughs> uh, one day we get to laugh about it like <laughs> do you remember when i locked you in the sauna we're an alien and then she died <laughs> thanks for coming um so yeah okay we've got a bar as per usual label go to the bar on this whole wedding oi come here come and sit down so right um so thanks for coming actions okay add group i don't know if this is gonna work or not so who 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 who's who's in a wedding party um so thanks for coming actions add group chance i right, more choices actions add group um more choices actions add group okay because whenever your sims get married, they always get married by themselves, all alone, for no one watching them. And so oh, that's a bit sad, isn't it? So could everyone drag yourselves away from the bar and come and watch me and my fiance get married? That'd be brilliant. So get married to 51. There we go. So that's so what is he wearing? Oh, he's wearing a little tuxedo with a bow tie. Oh, he looks, he looks so happy, don't he? He's like, oh, I'm getting married to my love of me life. Okay. I think I should have gone for like a golden wedding, but okay. Um, I think that's probably like one of the requirements for this challenge. I'll just be tough points. That's okay. I've done a stupid thing. I've detox the points. Bye. Okay, can we get on with this, please? Can we stop talking? I've only got 9 hours and 15 minutes, which sounds a lot, but that goes very quickly. There's just so many people. Who is here for my wedding? Or oh, Scarlet's wedding, not my wedding. <sighs> okay. Can we, can we, this is, I oh know this is a great angle. Um, can we stop talking to everybody and just drag them? No, and then just take them to our, our, our this is a good view, to our, our, our place of being married. Thank you, right, can you, 
Can you please to drag everybody over and get married? Right, come on everyone, take, you can take your drinks with you, but just come over here and watch me and my fiance become husband and wife, that would be grand. Um, just sit yourselves down, we've got lots and lots of seats, oh, and they're lovely. Just sit yourselves down, turn yourself around, oh, we're bouncing all over the place. Turn yourself around, you're gonna miss it. No way! No! Okay, you two. No! Jasmine, stay with us, please. Witness our beautiful uh, unitions. No, 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 no. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Jasmine, just staying. Okay, right. Would you, you take this man? Oh, oh they both got, they're both coming. No, no, there's an awful angle. Okay, right. Is this, right, we got, we got, we got some people. Okay. Let's do this. Let's do this. Okay, they're sitting down. Wonderful. Oh, <sighs> I have never had this many Sims sit down and actually watch the ceremony. <laughs> oh, there's always too interested with the bar. Right. Do you take this woman? And do you take this man, alien? Yes, I do. You, I, I pronounce you man and wife. Me may kiss the blade. Okay. I've never had this many sins. Actually watched a wedding ceremony. Hoo -hoo, and they're all our, 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 our wedding party guests. Yay! They're married! Woo! Okay. Um, I don't know where it is. So we've got some seating areas over here, but that's not where the kitchen is. But we've got a bar, got lots of bars. So that's the kit that's the bathroom. Am I really blind? And then there's the sort of high pianist. And then I can't see a kitchen. Right. Do we have a caterer? Is are you a caterer? Oh, hey, we do. Why don't they like each other? Are you the caterer? Is that why you're sitting all down your butt because you haven't got any kitchen, right? So let's let's just quickly put it in the kitchen so the caterer can make a cake and then we can cut the cake and then when the wedding's over they let's gonna be over and then there you go. So it's very lovely, but let's just turn on PP dot move objects on. I don't wanna delete it because someone's worked very hard putting all this together. So that didn't go wrong. BB dot move that's nice work. There we go. So I don't want to delete it, so I'm just gonna move it into the sitting area over here. There we go. There we go. Just pop it down there. Oh there we go, just pop it down there. And then we are just going to pop quickly pop down like a little kitchen, kitchen area down here. So we need to grab a a nice white looking whew, um kitchen counter so let's pop that there okay there we go and then we're going to pop a little stove area here so grab that there we go and then a little fridge a nice fridge all that nice a little fridge that's a that's a blue one but it looks white in this lighting there we go and then the caterer should hopefully like you know make stuff so now she knows she's got kitchen, she should stop taking a break and cook a cake. You sweetie, I, I put down a little kitchenette, there we go. Go off and make a cake. Stop being offended by this mixologist. Go on, make a cake, love. I put, I put down a kitchenette. Okay, right. Talk to your husband, since he won't be around long. Um, so go and brighten your day and um, kiss cheek. Is there any sort of like romantic things we can do or now we're married? Uh, romance, uh, more choices, profess undying love, could do that. Sweet talk, get your charisma skill up. And um, where's my wedding party? Oi, come back, come back, go back to the bar, yes chance. Right. Okay, chance some of my wedding parties moving their way over to the bar. Landlady's found her way back. Wonderful. Don't mind chance. It's not insulting that um 
I'm performing romantic interactions with my husband. <gasps> but then again, he's just seen us get married. But okay. Um, so, tell engaging story. Hello, chance. Um, oh, I know what she can do. Um, she can check if she's pregnant or not at her wedding day with another bloke. So, could you please uh, take a pregnancy test, please, once you've talked to your husband? Um, and then you can have a boogie. Or, uh, and then you can have a boogie, yeah. So how long have we got going? Oh, I'm sorry Chance, yeah. I'm with him now. <laughs> so sorry. Um, we've got 6 hours and 13 remaining. Yay! We reached level 7, Christmas 7. Uh, yes. Uh, so that's great. We just need to get to level 10. We need, how many is it? So what number is midnight 51? What, what number, what? Um, Glazer Rock, fantastic. Do you like to come here? Do you like to come to my, your mum's? Bring Raven Master here. There we go. So, what number is um, midnight in the um, marriage count? Uh, so, we've got, let's check our ghosts. So, we've got one, two, one, two, three, plus, plus Raj. And then midnight. So, midnight's the fourth person so we need to get let's go on quickly okay sit down have a pregnancy test uh say congratulations to your stepdad yes I say hi congratulations um I talk about toys here's like my toy uh take tell make believe story he really wants his cake this Oh no! We need to try again with Roland. No! Congratulate! Well done for marrying my mum. Um, warn about us uh, being a ghost. Got he got warned about that. Oh no! What's that? Fail to conceive. Oh. Mm. Well, have a little boogie down. Have we got our cake? Midnight wants his cake. He's thinking about got cakes. Uh, no. Right. I'm gonna get Scarlet to make the cake then. Um, so you cook. Same cook. Yep, there. White cake. Okay, white cake. The caterer is now doing her job right. I don't know what I'm doing. And that's one ping about all over the place. Right, so compliment outfit. You look great, lovely in your um, tocks and your bow tie. Like really suave and dapper lovely. Complain about here, I'm really getting hot in this really heavy wedding um, dress. Offer a rose, here's my rose to you. Flatter, bright and day. I mean, you married Scarlet, wouldn't your day be bright and day anyway? Um, where is our, where is our um, cake? Where's me cake lovely? Right, okay, we've got a cake, right. Can I grab this cake? No! There you go. Right, all right, we're going to add wedding topper, cut the cake, and then they're all gonna go home because they're really, really tired. So adding wedding topper, okay, where is where is he? Because he might be closer and less sleepy. So um, I just want to move to Scarlet. I just want to click on Scarlet and click on the end direction. Right, right, with, <laughs> oh, that's the snow globe. Um, so add wedding top her. I'm going to teleport her here because she's knackered. So off you go, sweetie. And then there we go. And then quick this up a little bit. Add the wedding cake top her. Is that on? Right, yes. So then you're going to cut the wedding cake as people doodles. Cut the wedding cake. A Woo -hoo -hoo. Yeah! Okay. Then everyone's gonna take a slice. Everyone takes a slice now. Uh, take piece together. Yes, take piece together. Oh! 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 <laughs> so funny. Okay. Everyone grab a slice and then it's Spock's birthday. No, it's not! <laughs> Okay, so I'm gonna leave this part here. So in the next part, um, 
We are going to celebrate Spock's birthday, even though you can't celebrate baby's birthdays, but we're going to do it anyways. Um, we can perhaps tie it in with the dinner party that we're going to have. Oh, we're going to have two toddlers. <laughs> so I'm going to see you in the next part. Um, so thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe if you have enjoyed watching. Hopefully you enjoy whatever you're doing with your daedals. And hopefully I'll see you next time. Thank you.